Hello, welcome back to Kaiju tutorial series. Today we're going to continue the inventory tutorial series. We're going to test the create method that we had, had done in the previous part of the tutorial series. We're going to use Postman to test the various endpoints of the API. So to do that we need to send a JSON body. So to find that you have to go inside of Postman you have to go inside of body then select a type. It can take various types example text but in our case we need JSON. So we're just creating the parameters to simulate what would be sent via app or website or so to the API. We're going to be sending the brand name as well as the if it's deleted or not. The ID will be automatically generated so we don't need to send that. So we need to remember to set the type to a post. But if you notice here, uh, brand name did not send so we need to check the API to see what is missing. And it seems what happened is that um, we need to add the body parcel to allow the API to accept JSON format, body format, and other various formats. So to do this, we need to import, we need to use npm and install the body parser. So that's npm install body parser. Once we have installed it, we need to declare um, what aspects of the library we're going to be using. So router.use, in this case, we're going to use the body parser, URL, encoded. And we're going to say that it's extended. We're also going to use JSON, upset JSON, as well as raw text as well. Okay, let's try again. Success this time it adds successfully. All right, so in the next part of the tutorial series We're going to create the fetch method to retrieve this information from the API